Hey guys, and welcome to the At Home Core Series again. Here we are, we're gonna run through a bicycle crunch, which I know that you've all done before. I'm just gonna give you a few tips on how to perform that a bit more optimally. So we're gonna take a lay down on the ground with our knees in our, hips in our knees in a 90-90 position, and our hands are gonna come behind our head. So make sure you're not grasping your fingers behind your head and pulling your neck up keeping our neck in a neutral position as well and our elbows are out to the side. What we're going to do here is drop one leg down towards the ground and then rotate across. So my right shoulder lifts up coming towards my left knee and then swap to the other side. Ideally we do this exercise at this pace, nice and slow and controlled. My pet hate with this exercise is seeing people going super fast what I want you to do is slow down the movement to get more out of it. So we're twisting going side to side, keeping our core nice and strong with our lower back in that nice neutral position that we've spoken about before. Hopefully that one helps you feel the burn through a bicycle crunch. Cheers.